Hey guys, so welcome to another new issue of Banknotes. So today we have the Solomon Islands $10. And as you can see, it is a polymer banknote, which they have issued to commemorate the 2023 self uh, Pacific Games in the Solomon Islands. So we have an eagle. Looks like a type wedge tailed eagle. Probably not a wedge tailed eagle, but different. Okay, Solomon Islands. It's a you know pinkish, reddish color. And then we have the coat of arms, and as you can see, we have a shark and a probably saltwater crocodile stylized and also different birds in the fields um, a shield and spear tortoise so pretty much stuff to do with um the ocean and we have it a, a knight's helmet obviously that relates to the monarch because they are still headed by the monarch and then, then we have the nice flag so we have the Southern Cross, I think that's the Southern Cross. And the actual blue shield separated, separating the green with a yellow line. And we have a, another stylized crocodile there. Down below, we have what I commemorate So is the athlete, so we have uh, a runner, soccer player, a weightlifter and a bodybuilder. And here we have basketball and uh, rugby. So just in case you're in America, rugby is like gridiron, except they don't use uh, actual... Oh, what does it say? Yeah. They don't have helmets or anything. And this is obviously the logo of the games. Not too sure what it represents, but it looks, yeah, it looks quite nice. Very well designed. So this one is SI, so Solomon Islands 23. So that's a date. So SI, there is one million of these banknotes, looks like. Then we have X, X23. So it looks like there's also another million. So obviously at the moment, I think there's two million banknotes printed but I'm not too sure if you look at how much these cost so we've got 36 listings these are all in US dollars so for buy it now you'll be paying uh, six dollars plus six dollars postage so it's about ten dollars so about twenty dollars Australian postage so basically if you're going to buy this I'll buy multiple items from the seller and get combined postage and then you've got biddings so if you buy for that much, I wouldn't bid up higher than any of what it is now. Okay, you got another bidding. Okay, then you got buy it now, a bit more expensive. And here they get a lot more expensive. Now, if I was going to buy these, I'd buy it from China. I have never had a problem buying from China. You know, it, people say, oh, the China produce fakes. Yeah, they produce fakes, but then they spread them all over the world so you can Get them from any country, really. Yeah, Ukraine, I've never had a problem with. Thailand, yes, I've had lots of problems with Germany. So if I see something sold from Germany, I try not, I, I don't buy it. Saudi Arabia, never purchased anything from Saudi Arabia before. Mm, but it was always the first time. And uh, that, that seems to be the most expensive one because of postage. Okay, then oh yeah, here's the ones issue for circulation, specimen notes, whole bunch of coins which I, I don't want. So paper money. Get rid of that. Okay, oh it's also got rid of a lot of the results as well. But yeah, what can you do? Okay, this one probably doesn't have postage. Some of them don't. So that is basically sums up that banknote. It's actually quite nice. And I reckon you should get it for your collection if you're into modern banknotes. Okay, thank you and goodbye.